All right, welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. We are going to go for our next supply raid. And that's going to be quite an important run for us. So let's see that we are A, not having any... We really want to do that flawless, so we don't want to have any injuries. And secondly, we want to make sure that we effectively train a lot of our guys. So that's going to be my team. Part of the A team. Part of the B team and our skirmisher. Let's make sure that we can get all of the support onto them. Nice little gun. We will give the gun the extra magazine. It's fine. Roby. Roby definitely needs a proper gun. Nice, we got the plus one uh, damage on the swords from our mission as a reward. She already has the upgraded sniper, which only leaves Mox, and Mox could upgrade with a stock. I like it, because he has two shots. Absolutely makes sense. Great, let's go guys. Let's fucking go. So the idea of the supply rate should be to really take zero damage. I don't know if all of the supply rates are now going to be um, based on a timer mission, but if it's uh, a non-time supply rate, which is... Um, the, which was the standard in the old game, then that should be one of the most easy going missions ever. With enough time, we shouldn't take any damage. And they've left plenty of cargo for salvage. That's where we come in. Once you're on the ground, eliminate all hostile contacts and secure the area. Seize anything of value. Great. Let's go. Menace one five. Coordinates of the advent train are locked in. Move to secure. Eliminate nice. all hostiles. Commander, I'm getting faint traces of a signal coming through. Someone on the ground is trying to reach us, but I can't make. These here are new Keep textures. I love them. Look at that. We have a swamp landscape. Really, really good. Holy moly. Heading out. Question is where's the high ground, right? This year this year could be a little bit high ground, but not noticeable. To that position. Ah, I knew it would happen sooner or later. It looks like they're still serving as the aliens front line though. Rolling. You clearly can tell that I'm not very surprised and also not very happy with uh, seeing mutants here. Hmm. There is no high ground, which means we are in a really, really tough spot here. I go as ordered. Okay. That's affirmative. Moving on target location. Trying to get everyone into a proper position where they can fight. That's the equipment we're after. We'll have to do our best to avoid destroying the gear while we secure the area. I'm on it. It is under my scanning. Moving to Overwatch. They're on 
So typical, by the way. It was so typical. Of course they are. done anything This is for you So we'll give him an extra time unit, by the way. But let's make sure that we kill this mutant first. Okay. Good shot. He would move up to here, he could shoot rockets, so we need to prevent that from happening. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's an excellent time to give him the teamwork bonus. To fear. Ninety percent chance. Sounds like a great idea. Although he could also use another rocket, but they are too far away. So, never mind. Ninety percent chance looks uh, sounds like a great idea. This here should be a flanking shot, no and also it moves us far enough uh, away from one another to not be target of um, of his missiles. Nice little flanking shot there. Yeah, and probably that's the best tech, uh, best idea because it'll disable both of. Um, both of the humanoids. That was close. OK. 
Okay, that was way better than expected. Let's start with shredding him, shall we? Very good. Suppression removed. And now we can effectively kill him. There you go. Even better. Can't grapple anywhere. Down to one HP. Ammunition depleted. And we got a stock here on on uh, whiskey, so we're going to kill him regardless. close as one would want to be with a stun lancer if, if you means so. we're going to go back overwatch and let him come You must be shitting me, right? He still was in range. Oh my god. Wow. I'm baffled. Well, the old Saiken wouldn't have made that mistake. He would have known that Mox was in range. I'm going. Oh, yeah. I guess the range just surprised me. So I suppose we still have one or two more packs. The average pack strength is okay so far. What's over there? Whatever you say. A ten batal. 
We just shouldn't have pulled two of them at the same time. Okay, I'll go. I hope it's worth it. Back in. Overwatch. No trespassers. Reloaded. Come get some. I've got movement. Heads up. Say so. Small iterations of movement for us. I can handle that. Yes, come out there. I'm I'm trusting you here. I'm going. Just want to make sure that we're really on I'm one on line. Scanning. Because I'm Moving trying to plan an overwatch side. trap. Quiet. Did you hear something? There you go. That didn't do much. I've got eyes on an advent position. Purifier and a stun lance on top of a viper. Okay. So let's make sure we get the Viper 100%. We have the advanced stock here, which means we can simply kill. We're going to use 8 protocol on ourselves, and then we're ki killing the Viper. Very good, there's our loot. I don't want to take the purifier because we can't kill the purifier anyways. We have him flanked. If possible, let's get the stun lancer. You are judged. Very good. Very good. I like that ability. It's so good. When it comes uh, to fucking up enemies' cover. I definitely got that one. I guess that'll be okay. confirmed all hostels are down and the area is secure status confirmed mission good enough i really wanted to have the flawless mission so that was unfortunately not super good but overall fine propaganda effort is not funded from my research budget yeah could have done better now Mox, our skirmisher, is probably going to hit the sick bay for 20 days as well. Oh no, Roby was... No, I think Mox was the one... Mox or Roby. Elder 
Yeah, Mox, 20 days, like I was assuming it already. Robbie and Renwim seem to like each other even more. Wow, 144 uh, 44 supplies, alien alloys, 80, 30 crystals, that's pretty good. Amazing, to be honest. And we got ourselves another advanced stock and two cores. We're sitting on so many supplies. The bond between these soldiers continues to grow. They can gain additional tactical strengths if they continue their training together. Oh yeah, go for it guys. Benefits. When developed uh, on a covered action together, the duration is reduced by one day. Oh, cool. Then, the soldier is granted a bonus to aim when their uh, bound mate has attacked or been attacked by a soldier's target. An extra bonus is granted if the bond, uh, bond mate is adjacent. Cool. Stand by me when the soldier ends a move adjacent to their bond mate. The bond mate will automatically cleanse it of any negative mental effects. Oh. Oh. The bonds are really good. So yeah. The Prime crew, our A-team, is currently completely um, absent. They are training. That's good. I like it. There's Intel. I want to contact New Brazil for fuck's sake. Wonderful! Finally, magnetic weapons. To be an important These magnetic-based weapons are a lot like the early railgun prototypes. They fire projectiles at extremely high velocity. Commander, if we intend on discovering the purpose of the chip we so have rifle, we'll gun, need to pistols. research as soon as Probably that's the weapon of the shadow, and that's uh, the shotgun. Oh no, the skirmisher weapon. Oh, gotcha. Pistol, shotgun, rifle. And Gauss weapons. Well, Gauss weapons is what I wanted to do anyways, because that is uh, the heavy weapons part. And if it only takes 12 days, that's even better. So here we go, research. I assumed you'd make that research a priority, Commander. I'll notify you as soon as the report is available. That is damn good. We finally got some real weapons, guys. Build items, to do with their weapons, that point is up to them. upgrade Commander. our magnetic rifle. Yes, please. Upgrade the skirmisher weapon. Yes, please. Upgrade the pistol. Yes, please. Well, that's the shotgun. I'm currently not using shotguns. I'm not sure if that is going to change in the future, but for now, we don't really need it. Still got enough alloys in the supply, but I want to keep it that way. 
I've had a chance to take a closer look at some of the advent weapons recovered from the field. So, by looking at Rovi now, he certainly has a nice, nice little weapon. I'm guessing it's the same material we've seen them using all over the colonies, but they'd have to be producing it from something here on Earth. They seem to have an endless supply of this stuff. Great. Loving it. The heavy weapons are still not uh, upgraded but that will happen in 12 days so that was an important milestone it's getting better now I'm glad to see our joint effort cool off like we so hoped. we gain additional resistance orders and covered actions uh, it looks like Gur Hur Madrun has been uh, hiding out in North America between attacks and our forces our partnership has gotten us thus far now we just need to find out exactly in what hole this thing has crawled back into. We'll have to be careful though, once we have backtracked it into a corner, uh, it's sure to fight harder than ever. Okay. 8 XP, XP. Nice little thing going on here. on the Chosen during our last covert action. You're starting to win over my people, Commander. And that says something. New faction orders, ballistic modeling, and Hunt of the Assassin Part 2 is now available. My people are up for some... The speed of all weapon research is increased by 15%. Oh, really? Oh, really? That is pretty good. So here we would get a superior weapon upgrade, which is not bad, but it's certainly also not really, really good. We can get 44 intel. I like the health plus one. That is awesome. So... I am very tempted in taking that. Will plus 5 is also not bad, but health plus 1 is really good. Um, just to put it into context, I mean, health plus 1 can really make the, uh, the difference between surviving or dying a shot. You need enough health later on uh, to make sure that crits are not killing you. So I like that. The intel is good. We can use it. We don't have a lieutenant, so this uh, uh, this part here, Hunt of uh, the Chosen, would not be available. I would give uh, Zirkim the plus one health, because he's the healer, and he definitely needs to be the one surviving all of it. I could see how he and Edgar Alien Poe again are working together, and let's give them one, uh, one of our scientists. So that one is great. If we can upgrade it, we are going to upgrade it. Commander, we pushed our current power systems to the limit. Because with that, uh, with that upgrade here, uh, we can, I think, load a second, uh, a second order. Your resistance orders, yeah, manufacturing order, nice. We, we get two additional ones, that's great. So basically the hunt, uh, part one, already offered us, plus um, uh, offered us this extra slot. So basically if we uh, raise our influence to, part, to three, we get three orders here from the Reapers and probably then the, uh, we can do the fight against uh, the chosen one. Okay, got it. That makes sense. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. 
we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. So we have three more bleeps. We need to make contact soon. The elders have nearly come to realize their vision. And so it would seem time grows short for both of us, Commander. Supply drop is soon going to happen, which is perfect because then we can uh, finish the month. Enemy tech and psionic defense are doubled. Okay, it's okay. Got an urgent communication coming in for you now, Commander. Avatar Progress 3, that is bad. Alien Facilities 1, that's also bad. So we need to make sure that our number, our priority now needs to shift really towards making sure that the progress is being reduced. Our intel is indicating that the chosen assassin has increased in power, adding an additional strength that we need to be dealing with. Uh, with. Can summon advent stun lances. Hmm. It won't be long now, Commander. Just as your plans become clear, so too will the location of your avenger. Sun Lancers have a chance to move after melee attack. Chosen double their efforts to hunt the commander, seeking to capture XCON soldiers at every opportunity. Well, and another hidden one. Okay. I like the loot, that helped uh, a lot. We definitely need um, increased speed in, um, in weapon research. I like the additional res uh, resistant contact. The shredding could be good as well. It helps our uh, missions, but we need more overall uh, macro support. The fights themselves are fine for now, and it, it seems that the uh, Reapers seem to be like a faction that focuses on macro uh, game. So that's why I would want to take their bonuses. You are the boss. Commander, the chosen are getting closer to hunting us down every day. The only way we can stop them is to strike first, and we'll need to work on a covert action with the resistance in order to do that. We should head to the ring. Oh, he looks great. Eric, you're in on the team. Perfect. Need a couple more soldiers, to be honest. Yeah, maybe him. Derek Fisher. Looks good as well. And Corey. So, let's train Cory. Everyone is currently is currently working, so that's fine. Laboratory is going to be up in 13 days. Uh, the next covert ops mission might want to take someone. Uh, we might want to take it. Uh, take the rupees with us. Just to uh, to upgrade their rank. Besides, just out of curiosity, can we can we already train some new combat tactics? Still not. No, Captain. Well, waiting for that rank upgrade then. The two soldiers we sent to the training center have developed an even stronger bond. If we continue to send them out together in the field, their effectiveness will only grow. So we're making contact to Europe because I'm now going to follow the path that I originally wanted to take, which is making sure that we can go here and uh, and start infiltrating commander 
we want to set back the aliens' work on the Avatar project, we should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. No shit, Sherlock, really? Although we have allies scattered in cities throughout the globe who are willing to share their knowledge, rescue VIP, the scientist in 102 Intel. Okay, wow, that is the safety. That is definitely one of the best options that we can ha uh, take at the moment. 102 Intel. That is awesome. Plus, a scientist for faster research. Great. We're going to do that in the next mission, guys.